All right. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. My name is James Howard, and for this class assignment, I intend to do a Let's Play of the classic computer game, Where in the World is Carmen Sandiego? So let's fire it up and get started here. Now, if you're unfamiliar with the Let's Play, well, let's, let's move the mouse out of here. That's kind of distracting. A Let's Play, basically, I play the game, I narrate over it, and you, the viewer, are enthralled by every minute of it. So let's get on the hook. What? Ah! She's getting away! It's Carmen Sandiego! Yeah! Get her! Somebody chase her! Anybody! Yeah! Police! Oh, stop shooting at me! Oh man, this is intense! Look at them go! Look at them go! They've got one arm each! This is very important! Excitement! Carmen's gang has pulled another caper and it's up to you to crack the case in... Where in the world is Carmen Sandiego? Copyright 1990, Bonapunk Software Incorporated, all right preserved. Yeah, theme music. You'll note 1990 means it was done before the game show, so no rockapella here, unfortunately, much to my chagrin. Um bop dum bop dum ba um bop bow. Um, oh, please identify yourself. All right. Well, if I'm going after Carmen San Diego, and I know I am, there's only one man bad enough for the job. John Shaft. Yeah. Man, like you never heard of John Shaft. Fine, I'm new here. Uh, I could use the mouse, but again, that's a pretty big cursor gets in the way, so I'll just use the keyboard. There we go. Rookie! Man, get on out of here. What is that rookie? Flash! <gasps> that's the treasure stole from Paris. <gasps> the treasure has been identified as the elevator from the Eiffel Tower. <laughs> yeah, I can see how somebody would make off of that. That's pretty... that's easy to lift. Female suspect, totally Carmen San Diego. Gonna track her down and arrest her. Yeah, that's what this game's about. Apprehend a thief by Sunday, 5 p.m. That seems a little arbitrary, but okay. Um, let's get to it. Little factoid on France, 55 million people, famous for wine, fashion, food, art. Okay, um, 1990 graphics, pretty cool. Little sidebar there. Uh, I've got four buttons. C lets us see the destinations that we could chase a thief to. From here, depart lets us pick one of them. So Oslo, Tokyo, and Reykjavik. Reykjavik? Reykjavik, Iceland. Uh, this is the questioning menu, I guess, so we can wander around and ask people about if they saw the perp. And the crime computer, so we could like enter in details and print out the warrant for the arrest. All we know so far is they're female, but I mean, it's got to be Carmen San Diego. So, all right, uh, let's check out the menus here. Got a standard game menu, new, save, quit, uh, options, you can play with the joystick if they still made them, um, player information in Acme, and then some dossiers of some people we've never heard of, and Carmen Sandiego, former spy, cool, uh, 1939 Packard convertible, and a fondness for tacos, so if I see a, nine, a 39 Packard going through a Taco Bell drive through obviously I know who I'm looking for. Well, let's start the investigation. Little footsteps on the way to the museum. Blah, 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 blah. Shinto rituals. Thanks, curator. I noticed it down to basically Japan, but we'll get some more information. I saw the person you're looking for. She asked about tennis match. Red and white foot. Those are huge lips. What the hell? <laughs> Could you get away with that in 1990? That's crazy. All right, so if we've got the information locked in. Let's go to the palace. Nice hat, brother. Biography of Emperor Jimmu. Jim, Jimmu? Jim, Jimmy. So, basically it's Tokyo, unless Oslo has a huge Shinto population and a bunch of emperors running around. Take the short flight to Tokyo. Take a nap. Good. And Tokyo. Overlooked by Mount Fuji, one of Japan's most famous sites. But who's here to see Mount Fuji? We got a hotel to check out. <gasps> it's, uh, it's a Beagle Boy from DuckTales. Or a vile henchman, I guess that works too. Um, wanted to know if steamer down the Tigris River. First off, probably not, and secondly, nice mustache, brother. I feel safer knowing you're there. Um, Bamako, I don't know what it is, paired now. Okay, so Baghdad, because what else has a Tigris River? Let's check out the airport here. My sources say an oil fit. That's the same pilot as before. I guess maybe he flew here with me. Um, there's supposed to be a fact book or an encyclopedia or something where I can look up, like, what would have an oil field in the Tigris River, but I'm pretty sure I know what I'm doing here. Blah, 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 disappointing. The book's about the Assyrians. I don't know why you would have books about the Assyrians. You're a privy counselor. But I think I've got a pretty good idea where I'm going, so let's head on out.
I still, I'll, I'll have to look up Bamako later. I have no idea where that is. But to Baghdad! Blah, 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 blah. Iraq bordered by Jordan, Syria, Turkey, Iran, Kuwait, and Saudi Arabia. You know, good neighbors. <gasps> the library? Ah, oh, no, we'll go to the bank first. Robbers love banks. Pit, 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 pit. We'll just sleep outside the bank, just in case. And, yep, there's that dude. We're just following him around, not going to arrest him or anything. Changing money to pounds, driving a limo. You, you're you the most cross-eyed guard in the world. Whatever, we got the info. So, female, tennis, and now limousine. I think that should be enough, so we'll compute. And it's Carmen Sandy! Like, it's Dazzle Annie. Who the hell is Dazzle Annie? Oh, uh, let's have a look. Dazzle Annie? Dazzle Annie Donk. Oh, that's quite the portrait. Blah blah blah, craving for shellfish. I don't know if I'm more put off by the headband or the last name Nonker, but I mean, character designs in the 90s weren't that hot. Whatever, if we got the warrant, let's go to the library. Blah blah vehicle, red, white, and black flag. Tattoo on her arm, okay. I would have needed that a couple minutes ago before I did the warrant. <laughs> Stupid librarian, think you're so helpful. Shouldn't you have like a bun with gray hair or something? To the foreign ministry. A suspicious person was here, and a suspicious per- A suspicious- Is this a man or a woman? I can't tell them. The mustache or the, the hairdo- the, I, I don't know. Let's get out of here. Um, Athens doesn't have a red, white, and black flag, so Cairo it is. Whoosh! Short plane ride. Cairo, Nile River, larger city in Africa, there's a sphinx. That's pretty much all we need to do about Cairo. Let's hit the museum. Wall there, he's just walking down the street like that, looking inconspicuous. <laughs> okay, Saxon manuscript. Good. Riverfront. Oh. <laughs> Take a nap. Okay, I'm talking to a parrot. That's pretty cool. The birds know what's up. Red, white, and blue flag. All right. Good. Thanks, little bird. Uh, let's go look somewhere else. Let's go to the palace. Yeah, Egyptian palace. And, uh, blah, 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 Big Ben. Oh, okay, that's pretty, that's a, that's a giveaway. Thanks, Palace Guard, with your beret and your chandelier around your neck. Let's head on out. I'm pretty sure, unless there's a Big Ben in Colombo I didn't know about, it's time to head to London. Yeah, who needs a fact book? Blah, 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 Big Ben Clock Tower, scene to your left. All right, let's investigate. Let's hit up the hotel and see what's up. Whoa! <laughs> oh, jeez. Throw a knife at my head, why don't you? Something suspicious going on. Thanks, house detective. I feel safer knowing that you're on the case. All right, let's head up the harbor. Surely this will succeed. Whoa! Where do you... Who has? Who carries an axe? Seriously? Seriously? Who brought? Who brought an axe to London? How did you get that on the plane? Whatever. It's got to be the foreign minister. Crisis elimination. Yeah. Dramatic music. There she goes. It's um. Dazzle Annie was her name. Yeah. There she goes. She doesn't look a thing like her profile, but we're totally on her case. Oh, it's the police! And they brought guns! Gunfire! Yeah! Track him down! One arm apiece! That's right, long arm of the law! Um, how's it going over there? You guys need help? Oh. Yeah! Victory! John Shaft saves the day, baby! Alright. Well, I think that's... You got a pretty good idea of the game from here now. So, there you go. Where in the world is Carmen San Diego? 1990 Rotorman software, blah 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 blah. Carmen San Diego. There's police map for Hand Lanny. Okay, good. Taking full credit for this. She was the one carrying the elevator, so I guess she was pretty easy to spot. And thanks for the good work. Yeah. Where in the world is Carmen San Diego? Earned a promotion. Yeah. That's right, I'm the boss of this place. Except there's one more clue to unwrap? Oh, what? Where the- Aw, poor Velma back in Book of Facts. Who's carrying that around? Great Eerie, Norman's post for a blank gold mount. Eerie? I- Eerie? I- I don't even know. How many is a good number? Six? I, maybe I'll just go with six. Alright, um, where is it? Six. Yes. What? Okay, um, I have no idea. Yuri, notable sports personality. How many runs can you win? No, eight? Yeah! Victory! Alright, no, Sleuth John Shaft is done for the day, thank you. Alright, good let's play, everybody. I, for one, feel enriched. Uh, well, I could watch this again, but I'd rather just quit the game, so... Oops. Okay.
Okay, or I'll break stuff. Either way. All right, thanks a lot for watching.